Alright, so I'm back from a pawn shop and I had a hard time finding some games I needed but I picked up a couple games today we have Quantum Fighter uh, I'll show you prices $6.99 I got these from a game store so I'm paying more here than I would do at a pawn store pawn store they'd be half this price but, but I think that I wiped them out of stuff I needed here we have Star Force NES Open. Most of these were $6.99. Oh, here we have a $14.99. Donkey Kong Jr. Destinies, Destination. Earth Star, $6.99. Phantom Fighter, $6.99. WCW Wrestling. Yes, I was a big WCW fan. $3.99. And last one I got here is Tiger Heli. Took me a long time to find this one out there. $6.99. Let me uh, check these games in and we'll get a new total. Wait, I don't think I showed you this one. Harlem Globetrotter. I got this in also. Paid $10 for it. So now, check this out. My total number of NES games I am now at 300 different NES games that is pretty exciting it's a good milestone for me and let's check out some of these games so I'm calling this my 300th game Tiger Heli why because it's the only one I actually owned back in the day out of this group it's a great game Can I remember what else is going on here? All right. We got a lot of other games to check out. I want to make this quick because I want to show you uh, the 300 games on the media shelf. Donkey Kong Jr. That's a great game. WCW. Here we go. Is NWO in this? Let's see. 1989. Had the Road Warriors on the front of that. Ooh, Ric Flair. Nature Boy. Of course, Sting. Michael Hayes. Fabulous Freebirds. Wow, it looks just like them. Oh, I'm down. Oh, yeah. Hey, right, this is pretty cool. Next game. Harlem Globetrotters.
Oh, that camera's not that good. Destination Earth Star. That game does boot pretty much right up from the uh, start. Oh, uh, this one's not gonna work. Well, I had to clean this cartridge a couple times before it would work. NES Open Tournament Golf. Nah, it's still not ready. Hold on, I'll be right back. All right, I had to clean. I had to open this one up to clean it. I hit it with the eraser. And then brass oh, that sucker was dirty. Alright, where's the controller? Alright, got this figured out. Ah, I never played this game before. Alright, I'm not very good at it. Right, let me show you my media shelf for my games here. Hold on. Here are the uh, shelves I'm using. Each shelf holds 45 Nintendo cartridges. And so here are about 300. I don't know if I have them all on my shelf. I actually, I don't. Some are over to the side waiting to be cleaned. So I got room for plenty more. Oh, I get these shelves off of Amazon. Maybe I'll put a link below if anybody cares. And as always, thanks for watching. And remember to subscribe for more of my videos.